I'm just not sure who you're supposed to be loyal to in a world like that. This is Luke Hemsworth, the latest of a veritable invasion of Hemsworths from Australia. His two younger brothers, Liam and Chris, have had successful careers in film and television, and now with Luke's series regular role as Ashley Stubbs, a security officer of an Old West theme park in Westworld, it's his turn to shine. Luke actually paved the way for his brothers by being the first Hemsworth to get into acting, first appearing on the popular Australian soap opera Neighbors as Nathan Tyson, a jock who's not above juicing up a little bit for the big game. Look at that. He continued to pop up periodically on other Australian TV shows, playing a stable boy in the Saddle Club, an intellectually limited patient in the medical drama All Saints, and every once in a while he'd work with another one of those Hemsworths, like in this episode of The Elephant Princess. Sorry, cuz. We don't have enough room for all of you. But Luke actually took a break from acting early on, and financially supported himself and his growing family by starting a flooring business. Then right around 2011, Luke was motivated to get back into acting after seeing his brother Chris have success as Thor in the MCU. So after Chris asked Luke, a fitness enthusiast, to be his personal trainer on the set of Thor The Dark World, Luke uprooted his family, sold the flooring business, and moved to Los Angeles. What followed was a steady career as a dramatic actor in action films. He got had a taste of science fiction in Infinity. So we're talking serious time dilation here. And in Hickok, he played the gunslinger Bill Hickok, rooting and tooting his way through the Old West. You boys, put your tails between your legs. You get out of here. And what do you get when you take those two genres and just mush them together? Well, you get Westworld, which provided Luke with his first series regular role in a TV show as Ashley Stubbs, a security officer struggling to keep a robot uprising at bay. The only thing stopping the host from hacking us to pieces is one line of your code. But none of these dramatic roles even come close to the time he toured with a theater troupe on Asgard, playing the lead role of Thor, the God of Thunder, in a poignant reenactment of Loki's death with Matt Damon. Slowly but surely, Luke Hemsworth's career in film and television has continued to flourish, with Westworld being what you might call his first big break, following in the footsteps of his two younger brothers, who he's been nothing but happy for and has self-effacingly referred to himself as the short, dumb brother of the group. Uh, you shouldn't be so hard on yourself, Luke, and don't tell anyone, but you're secretly our favorite Hemsworth. <laughs> 